This is a song that got me thrown off the Kerrville Folk Festival. It's called Springtime in Uganda, and this is for Rod Kennedy and other people without hair. Towns got him a guest spot at Kerrville, and he sang the song about Idi Amin. Idi Amin should be hung by the balls and cut into pieces and tacked to the walls. Tied up with barbed wire and beat up with sticks. Relieved of his insides and filled up with bricks. Blaze said to me, Rod came up to him and said, we don't talk like that in the hill country. Because I think it's irresponsible for people to expect to bring uh, their kids uh, to a festival where, where uh, off-color language is used. Rod said, uh, we don't use that kind of language here at Kerrville. And Blaze said, well, I do. And he said, well, we don't play here anymore. From that time on, Blaze was banned from Kerrville Folk Festival. All the volunteers were on the lookout for Blaze, and if he was there, not to let him in under any circumstances. Rod's kind of a, he can be a little reactionary. So I thought, wow, this is too bad, because this would have been a lot of fun with Blaze here. And we're sitting, and it was sundown, and I was at the bottom of a hill, and I look up, and into the sun is this enormous woman in a sundress and I thought god she's a big woman ugly ugly I just look away and think wait a minute <laughs> and she starts kind of coming towards the campsite with that limp with that limp and I go no no way and I look at this place got a wig big heart shaped sunglasses put on a gingham dress and a bonnet and of course he still had the beard. He had makeup, uh, eye shadow and everything like that. And his duct tape boots. <laughs> you know, he didn't look anything like a woman, exactly. And of course he started singing. <laughs> At that point, of course, everybody knew who he was and he got thrown off the ranch sometime that day. <laughs> 